Let's take a look at uh, finding the value of normal distributions. Doesn't say doesn't say standard normal, but it actually gives you a mean, gives you a standard deviation. This is always based upon the area of the left, and that's the hard part is is reading it and understanding what do they mean by that. Well, if I look at some pictures, let's say they refer to the top 10%. They're telling you that 10% is over on the right side here, assuming this is the, the better side. Uh, if that's 10%, this has to be 90%. Now we're trying to find is that value underneath. And so the area to the left is going to be 0 0.90. It's to the left of this line right here. So you add up all the decimal to the left. Has to be in decimal form, you can't put 90 in. Let's say they refer to the bottom 20%. Well, they're telling us to put 20% in the left tail over here, which means this has to be 80%. And we're trying to find this value. And again, the area to the left of this line right here is 20%. And then if they're referring to the middle, 95%. They're telling you the amount in the middle is 95%. Since it all has to add up to 100%, if 95% is the middle, then we split 5% into the tails. So this would be... 0.025, and this will be 0.025. In this case, we'll be finding two values. The area to the left of this one, again, I'm looking at this line right here, the area to the left will be 0.025. On this one, the area to the left, I'm looking at this line right here, you have to add up all the area to the left. So you have to add up both these. 0 0.025 plus 0 0.95 is 0 0.975. Now let's say our mean, which is mu, is, um, I don't know, 20, 23. And sigma, our standard deviation, is 2. Let's find these values now over in Google Sheets. Remember, we want to put in norm I and V, area to the left, mean, standard deviation. So, first one, I got norm I and V. Uh, beginning parentheses, our area to the left, which is 90%, 0.90, comma, our mean, which is 23, comma, our standard deviation, which is 2. And then press enter. And that'd be our value. And our next one, norm I and V, 0 0.20, area to the left, comma, our mean, which is 23, comma, our standard deviation, which is 2. And then press enter. And I'll put them over here, these next ones. We got 2 on that last example. So 0 0.025, so equals norm INV 0 0.025, comma, our mean, which is 23, and our standard deviation, which is 2. And norm INV, the area of the left, which is 0.975, comma, our mean, which is 23, and comma, our standard deviation, which is 2. And press enter. And those will be our two, two answers for the uh, this example. And that's how you find values uh, in Google Sheets uh, for normal distributions.